Welcome back guys and we're here back on Project Sacrifice where we're going to be playing with Tinker's Construct. Let's get right into this video. So, how you would usually do Tinker's Construct is you'll get the, how I remember, shall I say, when I first started playing, which was like seven, eight years ago when I first play, started playing this with mods, Tinker's Construct was one of my first mods and I loved it. That's why whenever I see a mod pack with Tinker's Construct, I want to play it. And back then, you would just build, make the smart tree controller and build the small tree. But now, it's a bit more difficult. You can't just build it, because as you see here, we need molten copper. And the only way for us to get molten copper, besides that, but then we still have to pour it on, is to make a small little small tree. How many ingots do we need? Let's see. Four ingots. Luckily we have four here. Just take some coal. And there we go. With one piece of coal. This should boom. cook right up. Another one. Now I want to see. Okay. So I wonder if we can completely fill this up. Now with <laughs> there's so, oh so much seared brick we have. We place that and right click on that. You should see it go from ordinary brick to a smartest control. Excellent. What was my control? Weird. But that's only one step. We also need molten blazing copper. Which seems to be coal and to molten copper. But we don't have access to nether so far. So we can't get regular um, blaze bonus to smoke down copper. So we're going to have to smelt down some regular copper in here. Let's see. Can we get 12? Or would 12 be a thousand? Probably. Even less, maybe. Or more, sorry, more. <sighs> Lots of math today. Using me and everything. Let's see. Oh, one more. Then I should be able to right click. There we go. Nice. Now, the mixer, we need to right click you. Um, can I add a. No. Can add a chain drive here. Okay. That's fine. Ooh, piece of coal. That's what I wanted. Then, a little bit of coal. Let's see, can I... Oops, forgot my pickaxe. That would really help. Uh, there we go. Because if we can move that pipe, I'm just going to have to... Then one more. Oops. Uh, man. Uh, 
like that then just need to empty out okay there should be empty now let's see if i can patch the leak i made there we go mm, that's gonna stay okay now if we turn this on we should see molten blazing copper oh i've got the one of the most important i need a mechanical pump that would really help no wonder this didn't work yeah i'm gonna quickly organize this and get enough for a bucket and i'll be right back i've got the most simple blaze copper bucket now with that we can finally build the forge and i kind of want to turn almost this whole area into the tinker's construct so the pathways are going to be a bit narrow and that i can always expand the island if i want with the one section out of the island here okay so how the tinker's construct thing works is yeah now you can see so it can hold all of these ingots because of the space each one of these is nine blocks basically oh well, that's quite cool oh. nice but we need a few things shift add to Here we go. The very first page. Not that. I'm going to go backwards, in fact. There we go. Okay. So, as you can see here, we've got the seal controller. But... Man. <clears throat> Uh, I need a tank. So let me try. Weird. I can never get that to work. Okay. One more. Okay. So the idea for mount so it's holding no fuel gauge in good tank fuel tank here we go mm. so if we can so I'm unsure how many we're going to need. Because I don't see us needing many. But maybe it's not a bad idea just making two. While we still have the resources. <laughs> Slid down my chain right up to the mic. So, yeah. Russia. As you can see, I have a ton of these. If I just chuck some stuff away that I'm not going to need. There we go. And even more. Okay. No. Um. We need. I'm gonna try two tanks. I'm not sure if it's like gonna have any effect or like block me some way or stop me from doing it. Shall I say more? Hmm, nutrients. Okay, let's see. Yes. I know those two missing. Okay. So each one of these can hold quite a bit. I must just make sure 
Yep, yep. And now there's blood in it. So what I always love to do is just you open one block. I probably shouldn't put the fuel in yet. Hmm. How high do I want to make this? That's the real question. Man. Okay, so let's just drain our leaf. I don't know what. Yeah, I don't have a duct. Shoot. Uh, let me see. Do I have any clay? No, I don't. Because I used it all from ground. Hmm. Uh. There you go. Clay balls, crush, grab them. Let me grab Ricky Sand. There we go. Just so I don't have to run around and make it. Okay. Turn this off. Turn that on. I have whole process going. Let me quickly make this book and I'll be back. And as we place this last block in, <laughs> kind of a giveaway, but <laughs> look at that, almost 8,000 ingots. I can, <laughs> oh, it looks ridiculous. Oh. These over here, which I can use for just little costs, like that, easy enough. Now, I am unsure what I want to try with this. Wait, I just want to check. Sink and copper. Okay. So if I chuck a bit of zinc and a bit of iron, just iron's not even gonna melt. I shouldn't need probably. Shins. Wow! Wow! Let's see if I can chuck a. Oh. Man, but look at that. Look how slow it is. Oh, one of these, and then that just falls up. Let me see. Is there like a there is? There's glass. I can add glass. Uh. Uh, so if there's this, surely, see, so that's after the, so the glass, yes, okay, I'm, I'm a be, like, right back, and after a little bit of time, hmm, should I show you guys? Yeah, and ta-da! <laughs> ah. So this I can of course make get taller and that, and, but before I do that, there's a certain thing I want to do, which I'll probably do. I'll see if I do this, but. It's the seared stair or ladder small. So I would like to have one on the outside and then maybe on the inside. I'm not sure. Yeah, on the inside. So in case I fall in, I don't melt myself to death. But yeah, I've just chucked a bunch of copper in here so I can just to get everything moving. I mean, of course it has to fly away. 
Eh, no. Other way. Other way. Eh. No. Let's start. No. Uh, uh, uh. Shift that way. No. I want this thing just. Okay. That's fine. We've got. The thing is, we've got blazing copper over there. Fuel for us. We've built the cell, small tree. And we're probably going to end the video here. We have fun. Actually, wait. Shift and tin. We do not have a modification. Okay, stone. Perfect. Anvil. Any. Is that. Okay, we won't be able to get an anvil because that requires. Um, we somewhere, somewhere. All of these need to be like handcrafted. Look at this. Wow. Just wow. Yeah. Let me grab a modify this workbench. Is there anything else? No. Okay. Cause things in that we can make always another time. Let me see if I have any. I want to show you guys. So now we've got the small tree. We've got all these nice tool benches. Unfortunately, we do need this anvil for some stuff, which is annoying, but we'll get to it. And yeah. Because for one of these swords, you need like a cast which you'll make a mold out of, like any of these. Like here, you've got a part builder, so you'll put this in with your resource of something there. And you'll make whatever that is, you'll bring it to your tinker, tinker station, you can make it. Then you can bring it to your modifiers, workbench, and add modifiers on and everything. Which is going to be really good. If we had that anvil. Because without that anvil, I'm, I don't think you can make all these metal tools. Unless you can make it in this one. But I remember there being a certain block for it. And I've got a feeling it's that anvil. So, next, next episode or next episode, we'll see whichever comes first. We'll decide on how we're going to craft that anvil of what. I think that's where I'm going to end it for today, guys. I really hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next episode. Bye-bye now. Oh.